Books have value because they remind us of the great ideas and the great things that uh, have gone on in the past. And this is sort of an interesting example of just exactly that. This is a little booklet that uh, is Coral Gables, America's Finest Suburb, Miami, Florida, and it's written by Marjorie Stoneman Douglas. Um, Coral Gables was developed by a man named George Merrick. George Merrick moved to Miami with his family in about 1898 and later on developed their um, pineapple farm into what became Coral Gables. Coral Gables was sort of the height of the City Beautiful movement. Uh, George Merrick attempted to make a city for the first time, really, or one of the very early times, plan a city other than streets and avenues at perpendicular angles, and he also wanted to have a place that would be beautiful. And so he planned every building, really, the um, Mediterranean revival style of architecture sort of hit its peak. This particular booklet was printed in 1920, which would have been the very beginning, in fact, in 1920 is when George Merrick sold his first lot. And the woman who has written this is Marjorie Stoneman Douglas, who's better known for her work with the Everglades. Uh, she wrote the Everglades River of Grass in the 1940s and for the remainder of her life, and she lived a long time into the uh, 2000s, she died at age 108, but the remainder of her life was spent um, taking care of the South Florida wilderness, which became the Everglades and became Everglades National Park. And so, this little booklet couples George Merrick, the early pioneer of South Florida, and developer with Coral Gables, which was at the height of the City Beautiful movement, with Marjorie Stoneman Douglas, who became perhaps America's greatest environmentalist and conservationist.